YouTube. She's out here riding around right here. This girl right here in this black car watching a movie on her cell phone. Watching a movie on her cell phone while she's driving down the road. She almost ran into me. That's the only reason I figured out what the hell she was doing. So, I am, uh, I don't know, 61 degrees in the middle of January. I guess we all know what I'm doing. I'm out burning up gas and riding my motorcycle. Having a good time here. Thought I would uh, bring you up here in the town where I live. Take you in town this time instead of out in the country. Over there to your left is uh, Southeast Missouri State University. Uh, it's our college. Um, there it is. A lot of money spent right over there. So I'm going to run you down the street here, and I think that I'm going to run you out to a little place I like to go sit sometimes and just kind of look at the clouds and it's quiet. But in the meantime, on the way there, let's, uh, let's look at all the people that don't know how to drive. White car right up there, driving wrong one way and the wrong way. I don't know what the hell they're doing. And then there was a cop that just went by that didn't do anything about it. So people are retarded cell phones have made people more retarded put your cell phone down and drive your car please 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 this is the city of Cape Girardeau uh, this is the street here is Broadway this is kind of like the middle almost the middle street going right down through the middle of town from uh, east to west um, this one will run you straight down to the river the Mississippi River and uh, I'll run down here and we'll point it out. Maybe, depending on how long this takes. I don't want to burn up a whole lot of your time today. But man, it is beautiful out here today. It is showing 50, 59 on my uh, bike thermometer. So it was 61 when I left the house. We'll call it 61. That makes me feel better. But we are out riding and it is January. So... Who's going to complain, right? So it's amazing that uh, when I said I was going to point out people that can't drive, everybody's doing a good case of, got the case of drive right, and they're doing the right thing. So that's good news. But this is a, a two-way street. This isn't the, uh, isn't the four lane that I just come off of. Got cut off three or four times up there. Now there's a, there's a, I don't know how to parallel park person whatever just just do what you want um, a tower right there that big tower that's our uh, local news channel that's their facility KFVS channel 12 Cape Girardeau Missouri and right there in front of you that big body of water that is the mighty Mississippi River so you can see the flood wall down there uh, they close that up when the river gets high the there's marks down there that's almost been all the way up on top of the river. Uh, I'm not going to go there just yet. We're going to make a left turn here. This is Old Town Cape Girardeau. This is kind of what started it all right here on the riverfront. That uh, river wall didn't used to be there and the water at times would be all the way at least up to here where I'm at. So we're going to go... Uh, might be a break in this today because part of this little road out here is boring as it can be it just goes through a neighborhood um, straight ahead there the big building with the tan on top is Isle of Capri Casino it's been here for three or four years I guess but uh, still going strong three or four restaurants inside of there I have uh, I have not gambled one measly cent inside of that place, but I have been in there and uh, well, I guess I guess I'll take that back because I ate the buffet, and sometimes buffets are a gamble. So, but anyway, I've ate the buffet several times. But that is our casino, and uh, in Missouri, uh, casinos have to be what they call a uh, it has to be a boat. So what they did there is underneath that building, it, the whole casino platform is sitting on a body of water. They built a, built like a pond and attached it to the river and, or something like that. But anyway, it's supposed to be floating. Anyway, uh, so listen, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to go out this road here a little bit. I'm going to cut this off and I'll cut it back on when the road gets back. I made, uh, I'll, uh, I'll be right back. down the road I was on for a little bit. 
I made uh, made one turn and uh, come out this road. So you'll like this, I hope. If not, eh, I guess wrong. So, like I said, sometimes, uh, sometimes, dog almost got me there. Sometimes you like to have a place in town that uh, where you can ride to and just kind of find it to be quiet place that you can be by yourself people leave you alone it's not always like that out here but uh, sometimes it is and uh, either way people out here or not the uh, the view is really nice City water purification plant. Mandatorily brand new, and uh, everybody had to pay more on their water bill for that. Yeah, thanks. Thank you. Right over there, well, let's see. Let's don't talk about that yet. So here we go. You can see the body of water all up there in front of me. Uh, we are back right here along the Mississippi River. Um, we'll start up here. We'll swing around this loop. There's a car here today figured there would be since it was nice but uh, this is an overlook they call this Cape Rock Park and an overlook of the Mississippi River like I said I figured there'd be some cars out here today take a good look we'll go around this and we'll uh, look like a little secret rendezvous we'll go around the corner here and uh, go to the bottom down here at the bottom you can uh, walk right down to the river S had many a friend run off this road run off this road uh, doing things they shouldn't have been doing so uh, we'll play it safe today whoa hey stick in the road Oh, train down here screwing up the whole process. What a bummer. Well, I guess you're going to get to look at a train. Here, Burlington Northern, enjoy it. But if you can look through the train, you can see the river on the other side. And when the train is not there, you can walk down and there's some bluffs right along the side of that track. There's some... Uh, like rock bluffs that you can go down there and you can just kind of sit right on the edge of the river so I know you're not supposed to cross the tracks you're not supposed to uh, you know you're not supposed to do a lot of things but anyway there's bluffs there you can go sit right on the river so that's where I was headed that was my plan uh, thanks train appreciate it trains trucks and automobiles transportation so I guess I really can't complain because if it wasn't for transportation I wouldn't be uh, be able to afford anything that I have. Oh, there ain't even a train hooked to it. Must be going the other direction. Oh, well, we tried. We're out here by the river. So, hey, uh, that's it. Just a little bit of my hometown here. And, uh, there you go. Hope you enjoyed. And I'm going to try to come up with some better topics and make these videos a little bit better. But uh, here we are, Cape Girardeau, Missouri, uh, LM4 Photo. You can find me on Instagram and right here on YouTube. So thanks for taking your time to watch. I sure appreciate it. Well, looky who I find. Old Pastor Billy from the Rock and Roll Biker Church. He sees me. Make sure I get him in one of my videos since he takes his time to watch them. I don't think that's his wife on the back, though, so we'll see how this plays out. Later.